This is Black History Month, our time to reflect on the contributions we have made to society. I was recently reminded of an ad that had been passed around called, What If Black People Didn't Exist? It cited many true examples of inventions in everyday life that great black minds helped to develop. But in some cases, the ads left the impression that without the black inventors mentioned, these items would not have existed in the first place. Not surprisingly, individuals with racist tendencies attempted to pounce upon this as an opportunity to debunk the merit of black genius in our society. And so, I would like to offer a new presentation of that list so that everyone, friends, observers, and bigots, can properly appreciate the black genius all around us. Jan Ernest Matt Zelliger didn't invent the shoe, but he did invent the shoe-lasting machine, which allowed mass production of footwear and finally gave the world affordable shoes. Andrew Beard didn't make the railroad car coupler, but as a railroad employee who lost a leg in a boxcar accident, he invented an improved boxcar coupler that allowed trains to be coupled simply by bumping together without the need of human hands. We all love wireless communication, but back in the 1800s, all you had was the telegraph. A black man didn't invent the telegraph, but Granville T. Woods invented the first telegraph that allowed people riding on trains to communicate away from home wherever they were. His invention was so great that Thomas Edison himself attempted to take Woods' patent by suing him. Edison lost the suit and later tried, unsuccessfully, to hire Woods. You see, even Edison knew black genius when he saw it. Black people didn't invent cataract removal, but a black woman, Dr. Patricia Bath, invented laser cataract removal. Or would you prefer the drills and grinders the doctors had been using? Black people didn't invent the dishwashing machine, but Dennis Weatherby invented the chemical formula that Cascade dishwashing liquid and all of its competitors now use. Garrett Morgan didn't invent the traffic signal, he invented the automatic electric traffic signal. Before his invention, traffic lights were controlled by a human being sitting at the intersection with a stopwatch in one hand and pulling the control levers with the other. Morgan's traffic light design became the national standard when General Electric bought his patent and mass produced them nationwide and they only stopped being used when the United States moved in favor of the current international standard of red, yellow, and green lights. And it's true, Frederick Jones didn't invent the refrigerator. But neither did Willis Carrier. Frederick Jones, however, did do something you might find more important. He made it possible for all Americans to have fresh food by inventing the refrigeration unit used on 18-wheelers and railroad boxcars. Black people didn't create the computer either. But what good is a computer without peripheral devices like printers, scanners, and high-speed internet modems? Dr. Mark Dean made bus control, the system computers used to hook up all those devices, possible. The list could go on and on, but the point is made. Black people really didn't invent a lot of things. We just invented the things people actually use. And so you see, black genius really is all around us.